How's it uh, going? Tatiana, how are you doing? Good, how are you? I love the green. Just for you. Just I for you. I appreciate it. A bit of green neon lighting. I feel seen. So. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, congratulations on the show. Thank you. Uh, it's it's lots of fun. I watched the I literally watched the first four this morning back to back, which I don't usually do, but it was uh -huh. it was so much fun. I uh, I got sucked in. Um, oh, nice. I have to I have to get the first important journalistic important journalistic question out of the way first. Cheeto fingers, they might change my life. I have to say, this is an ingenious thing. My brain right? was absolutely exploded at this this phenomenon that is Chio this is fingers. This why Jen is a very special person. This is why she's got a special brain that needs to be respected. <laughs> where 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 did that where did that come from? Whose idea was was that? Was that I something that someone had done before? Or? I assume that Jessica Gao came up with that because she's crafty and and enjoys enjoy, enjoys good food. <laughs> <laughs> um, but somebody, we just did an interview and someone said that there's a, a picture of Oscar Isaacs doing that, eating Cheetos with, oh. with chopsticks. So maybe it's like a meta, it might be like actually a meta level, you know, joke, Easter egg thing that I wasn't even aware of. It's a Marvel, it's going to be, an, I'm going to have to look for it in every single Marvel thing now. If there's not Cheetos, That's right. it's, it's not doing its job properly and we can That's moan right. at Kevin Feige. <laughs> <laughs> Um, there's some great, there's some great stuff in there. One of the things I love is the breaking of the fourth wall. I always like that in, in these kind of things. How much fun was it for you to, to not just play the character, but to also have that part of it? Because it's very rare in some of the things that we've seen recently, apart from Deadpool, which now obviously is kind of the, a part of the MCU. How much fun is it to have that as part of this? Because it gives it kind of a different feel to some of the other stuff. Yeah, for sure. And, and it, what's so great about it is that it's like, it is woven into the fabric of this character from was from the start, from the first time that we saw her in 89, I believe, or something like that. She was always aware of the audience or aware of the writer or aware of the camera, you know, so to speak, the perspective that's watching her um, as a superhero. And to me that there are so many factors that feel like, you know, there's something about being uh, so conscious of how you're perceived which is like part of her journey throughout the show um, is like, I'm being perceived so differently as She-Hulk uh, than I am as Jen Walters and how you contend with that complication. But then also knowing the audience is watching her. There's something about it that in that beautiful meta way really touches on, I think how women have to be so conscious of how they're perceived, but also where they are in a space and what their space is in that space. You know, there's so many layers to it in that way. And uh, and it was super fun to get to do it in a comedic way too, where you don't actually like, you're not like hammering those ideas over the head, but we're touching on them in a subtle way. Yeah. Well, how 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 did you get into the, the, the She-Hulk headspace? Was there a song that you listened to? Was there a kind of a you know, a McConaughey beating of the chest kind of thing. How did you, yeah, how did you get into the zone? I threw some people through a, a few walls before every take. Of and that was kind of, of the course. Um, I really love Sophie. Do you know that, that musician? She died a couple of years ago, but she, she was like, mm. she's always been my touchstone in, in so many artistic endeavors. But for me, there was something about her music that was like always part of when I went to set because um, there's something like industrial about the sounds they have like a kind of technical feel to them but at the same time she uses a lot of beautiful kind of like um organic sounds as well and she plays with that idea of perception her music videos are all like these wonderful things like the, the face shopping music video is like her face being like stretched in this un un you know like unreasonable ways and like the commodification of body and all of that so that thematically felt linked to me and she's <laughs> also fun and poppy you know what I mean so yeah. all of it yeah if you see a news report after this it says Tatiana Maslany got into She-Hulk by throwing people through walls that's right so lovely to talk to you thank you so much for your time I hope thank this you. goes down really well it's really good fun thanks so much thank you so much cheers ladies and gentlemen you're watching Hey, you guys! Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, Is yeah. that from the Goonies? Indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys!